Welcome back. In this video, I will explain the concept of Caesar cipher with the help of simple solid example. First, we will understand what is Caesar cipher. The Caesar cipher is one of the simplest and oldest methods of encrypting the messages named after Julius Caesar. This technique involves shifting the letters of the alphabets by a fixed number of places. For example, uh, with the shift of 3, here the shift is 3, so the letter A become D. Here we can see that the shift is 3 and the letter is A. We need to shift 3 times. So, 1, 2, 3. So, the uh, encrypted letter will be D. Similarly, for the B, it will become E because from here it is a letter B. And from this, we need to shift 3 times. 1, 2, 3. So, the uh, encrypted letter will be E. Uh, to encode a message with a Caesar cipher, uh, we need two things. The one is a secret message to encode and the key. Uh, your message can be anything as long as it is made up of the letters A to Z. For example, hello. And uh, your key can be any number between 1 to 25. Here we will consider a simple example with a message hello and a key is the 3. And this is a natural alphabetical order from A to Z. Here the key is 3. It means that for each word we need to shift a forward of 3 numbers. So, here we can see that for H. Here it is a H. For H we need to uh, count 3 numbers. So, this is 1, 2, 3. So, H will become K. Uh, for E, 1, 2, 3. And E will become H. And for L, 1, 2, 3. So, L will become O. And for O, 1, 2, 3. So, O will become R. That is what we can see here. H will become K, E will become H, L will become O and O will become R. So, encrypted message for hello is K, H, O, O, R. So, once you encrypt the message, next we need to decode the message. To uh, decrypt a message, we will need to know both the encrypted message and the key in which we was encrypted. Uh, in this, the encrypted message is K-H-O-O-R and the key is 3. So, this time instead of shifting our alphabets forward by 3, we need to move backward by 3. So, here we will consider the encrypted message that is K H O O R and this is the normal alphabetical order from A to Z and uh, here we need to shift backward. For K we need to count backwards and for K it will become 1, 2, 3 and K will become H and for H we need to shift backwards 3 numbers 1, 2, 3. So, H will become E. And for O, uh, 1, 2, 3. And O will become L. And for R, 1, 2, 3. So, R will become O. So, that is what you can see here. Uh, K will become H. H will become E. O will become L. R will become O. So, that the decoded word will be H, E, L, L, O. I hope the concept of encoding and decoding with a Caesar cipher is clear. If you like the video, do like and share with your friends. Press the subscribe button for more videos. Press the bell icon for regular updates. Thank you for watching.